Hey guys! All right, so this band has been requested by the masses. I mean, they've been out with pitchforks. Torches. Torches. What's the thing that you throw that blows up? Molotov cocktails. Thank you, because I always fuck up that name. So they've been out in full force in riot gear, flipping over cars, jumping on the hoods of the cars. Smashing windshields. Sm sm smashing Starbucks windows, asking for mocha frappuccino lattes afterwards. It's been crazy. It's been like... It's been like a new world order out there yeah. asking for this band. And things got even more escalated after we did Northward, which is Tony Hawk's project with uh, Flor Jensen. And yeah. Tony Hawk plays in this band. So they're like, oh, dude, come on. You did that and you're not doing these guys? You got to yeah. check out these guys. So and that's why we're here. We can't get enough of Tony Hawk. No, we cannot get enough of Tony Hawk. The guy has incredible half-pipe moves. I can't believe that in between X Games half pipes and all that nonsense he has time to play in these metal bands yeah. these rock bands anyways enough of that enough of tony hawk's uh talk let's check out the song by the way this is just audio because this is the only one i could get working that didn't have like copyright issues them copyright
<clears throat> All right. So, let me ask you, what did you think of that? This voice is so good. What, what, to me, this band, the, the way the song started and the vocals reminded me of another band that we did. Does it remind you of you of anybody? Maybe, maybe it's just me. Do you want to tell you who, who remind me of Visions Divine? Oh, I see it a little bit. Yeah. No, not, not the, the guitar playing. Like like that middle uh, section there with the solos and everything that, that oh. was absolutely like, like, like it mind blowing. Full, it was for like two minutes. Two minutes, like, but it was beautiful oh, and the way solos. they were changing yeah. and, and and different harmonies and like was, that that was sounds. amazing. Different sound, different style. I I love that. Like that middle part there was absolutely mind blowing. But if you if you just listen to the voice and the way the song starts, to me kind of remind me of Visions Divine a little bit. That. That very power metalish, like voice to it, like you know what I mean? Yeah. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Maybe people at home will say, well, "What the, what the hell you're listening to?" Like, not only you're losing your voice, you're losing your mind. Yeah. But to me, the start of the song, I've never heard this band before, so the start of the song kind of reminded me of Visions Divine. Even the vocals sounded a little bit like Visions Divine. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. You you don't think so? I think a little bit, yeah. In ter in terms of the vocals and how uh, you know. The, the vocals, it, the, the way melody the, of the vocals throughout. Yeah, know? and the song did start out kind of like a power metal. Yeah, so it, to me, kind of sounded a little bit like Visions Divine. But overall, what did you think? It was really good. Yeah, I enjoyed it myself. I, I, I love his vocals. His voice is really incredible. Like, it has such a, a beautiful dynamic to it. It, it. You know what I mean? Like, the, between the, the two parts for me that made this song a very good song was obviously the vocals, but and that middle. Two. Oh, Honestly, <clears throat> when that part was going on, I was saying to myself, "Shit, man! If the if this song was all instrumental and it was just that, I, I would be um, I would be happy with that because yeah. it was absolutely beautiful. The guitar was so beautiful, like the melodies and, and the way it sounded and like it was going in different directions. And it, oh my god, it was so good, so good. And then it got like it, it it was a really good guitar solo, and then it got really really like distorted, and it sounds so good." Yeah, the guitar, the guitar in this in this uh, in this song, overall the guitar playing in this because the starting riff is really cool too. The the starting riff is really cool. So the guitar playing for me in this song is really outstanding, outstanding. All right, I guess we'll be checking more Pagan's mind in the. I'm yeah. not gonna say in the near future, but in the future we will check more. I mean, now we have to. I mean, it's been like six months since they asked. Yeah, so then I we guess teased them a little bit with the Tony Hawk and uh, yeah, Northward. Northward. Yeah, now we gotta do. Now we did this video, so maybe in a month or so we'll do another one. We'll see what people say in the comment section. Maybe this is not their best song. Maybe people will put this is this. Was, this is a really good song, but maybe people will put in the comment section, "Hey, you guys gotta check out this song. This is like the number one song to check out, and then we can check out that song." But this one was the one that I found that uh, seemed appealing. Some people mentioned this one as well, right? So I took yeah. that in consideration, plus the whole copyright stuff. So that's why we did this. But maybe there's a better song. I'm always in search of a better song. For better music. Yeah, exactly. So maybe people will help us out. And comment section below, that's what's there for. Not for you to tell me that I'm cringy. It's for you to tell me what song I should do next for Big Losing mind. Your Mind. Or that I'm losing my mind, or that I'm a pervert, or that I'm molesting you off camera, or some people say that you're Native American, or there's also some people that say that uh, channels like ours should not exist. So people use the comment section for all of those yeah. things, which is not what it's there for. It's there for you to tell us which song from Biggin's Mind we should do next. So use it wisely. With great power comes great responsibility. Oh, really? Yeah, that's from Spider-Man. You didn't know? No. Oh. But how did you know the line? I mean, it's... Everybody knows the line. Everyone knows Nobody the knows line. it comes from Spider-Man. No. Your lack of... of No, I don't remember what lack of... Geography? Is. No, not lack of geography. Actually, your geography is improving, I must say. Uh, uh, was it uh, that line from Star Wars? Uh, I find your lack of faith disturbing or something like that. No, well, Darth Vader says oh. something like that. Oh. Oh, never mind. Anyways, guys, we'll come back tomorrow, uh, and hopefully we won't mumble as much at the end of the video as we did now. See you tomorrow. See ya.